Hey, boys and girls, it's Mrs. Gaynor here going to read a story from Foundations called Jake the Whale. As we are reading this story, we are going to emphasize the scooping in the sentences so our fluency is appropriate for each of the sentences. We are also going to try and identify uh, vowel consonant E words. And we are also going to be taking a look out for our trick words for this new unit. So let's look at our story for today. The whale. What we're gonna do first is we're just gonna read it through and then we will mark it up. So let's take a look at our story. And remember, we wanna think about our five W words, who, what, where, when, and why. And we're gonna think about some of those questions as well to help us understand the story. So the title again is Jake, the whale. Jake the whale was very big. He had many whale friends. They all would ride the waves. One time, Jake and his friends were out on the waves and Jake dove down into the sea. He went to hide and his friends did not see where he went. They could not get him. I think that Jake is lost, said one of his friends. But Jake was not lost at all. He did a flip and a jump and was back with his other whale friends. They all swam into the big waves and had fun. What a great story. So I have my main character, Jake the whale. What were they doing? Hmm, they were out swimming in the water. Boys and girls, what was the problem in the story? Think to yourself, what was the problem? Right. He went to hide and his friends thought that they, he was lost. Excellent. But was he really lost? Nope. He was just under the water and he came up and he did a flip and a jump and he was back with his friends. So he never was lost. He was just under the water. And it was really nice that they had a fun time together. So now that we've discussed some of the things that happened in the story, we are going to now mark up our story. We are going to be looking for uh, vowel consonant E words. Let's take a look at the story. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go line by line and see if we can identify any vowel consonant E words and mark them up. So, Let's take a look. I'm going to use my pen. So, Jake the whale was very big. Ooh, I see two words in that first sentence that have a vowel consonant E rule. Do you see them? Let's check it out. Okay, I see the first word, Jake. So, I'm going to mark up my word. I'm gonna underline it. I'm gonna put a vowel consonant E. Then I'm gonna cross out my E and that makes it a long A sound, Jake. Now, the other word in the sentence is whale. So we have a long A sound because the E gives all of its power to the A. So I'm going to mark it up by underlining the word, putting vowel consonant E underneath, and putting my long A sound over the A. Awesome job. So let's take a look. He had many whale friends. We see the, whale, the word whale again. We're going to underline the word whale. We're going to cross out the E. We're going to put a long A sound above the A, 
and we're going to do vowel consonant e all right friends now you are going to continue reading the rest of the story and you are going to mark up our vowel consonant e words just like i did if you want to pause the video right now you can and then in just a few seconds we'll take a look at all the words that you should have marked up on your own all right good luck boys and girls this story so here is how i marked up the story and let's take a look at yours and let's see if we marked up the same words so in the third sentence we have waves like we did before we circled the suffix s underlined the base word did vowel consonant e and put a long a sound above the a the line above the a so then we have the word time we have underlined the word crossed out the e for the line above the i and then vowel consonant e underneath we have the word jake again we have waves and then on the following line, Jake again, dove. So we underline the word dove, crossed out the E, put a line above the O for a long vowel sound, vowel consonant E underneath. Then we have the word hide. Once again, underline the base word, cross out the E, put the line above the I, and write vowel consonant E underneath. Excellent. Then we have the line, the on the following line, the word Jake. Vowel consonant E underneath, cross out the E, put the line above the A for the long vowel sound. Then we have the word whale again and waves. Awesome job, boys and girls. Now what we are going to do is we are going to take a look and see if we can find some of those new trick words for this unit. I'm going to choose a different color and we're going to circle some of those new trick words in our story. So please remember, uh, you can pause this video if you want to take a second to see if you can identify those words first. All right, so boys and girls, let's do this together. Let's read through and see if we can circle our new trick words for this unit. Jake, the whale, was very big. He had many whale friends. Thumbs up, I hear a trick word, a trick word. we're gonna circle the word friends. Friend is our trick word. We have the suffix s at the end for making it plural. They all would ride the waves. One time, Jake and his friends were out on the waves and dove down into the sea. I see the word friends again. He went to hide and his friends did not see where he went. So we have friends again. They could not get him. I think that Jake is lost, said one of his friends. Here we have friends again. But Jake was not lost at all. He did a flip and a jump and was back with his other whale friends. Okay, let's circle that word friends again. They all swam into the big waves and had fun. Awesome job, boys and girls. Good see you my trick words. Um, our focus was on our word friend and our other one was other. So those are the two new trick words from our unit that we had in our story here. And if you were to take a look at your sheet, you should have marked up these other trick words as well. Awesome job. I am so glad I was able to read this story with you today and mark up the story with the different skills that we are focusing on. Great job, boys and girls.